Felix, probably. And Felix, yeah, and Felix. It's a good secondary. I don't know, like... Min-Min's a little over-tuned, if you ask me. Yeah, I'm like, I'm also, I'm, yeah, unless I'm missing something. I'm only really seeing, like, a handful of Min-Min players. Yeah. Anyway, look. Boring character. Next question. <laughs> I just wanted a, I just wanted a platform to complain a little bit about it. Again, right. I have a character that has an okay matchup against it, but still annoying. Anyway, let's talk about a cool character. Hey, look, we got a Richter Belmont played by Acetil on stream right now. Isn't that something? Dude, Acetil is a specimen. I mean, one of the Krupp brothers. Uh, they have no shortage of very good players to practice against at all times. And right. on top of this. They're hype. I mean, they're so aggressive at all times, uh, and they do a really good job of conditioning and making making sure their opponent is exactly where they need them. In one right. But look, this is one of the better zone breakers in the game, uh, and if Zekrom Amaterasu can keep Astil in disadvantage, you should be seeing this uh, matchup going to their favor. Oh man. Okay. Yeah. Finding themselves in a. Yeah, finding themselves in a bit of a tough spot. Uh, Amatros is trying to get back on the stage. There we go. Oh, and Astil's catching that roll to the stage with a down smash. And now, uh, finding himself back on stage, but it's going to be a little bit tough to see uh, how he goes out. Yeah, now we got to find out how we're going to go about what? that comeback. It's a, that was a good catch. <laughs> I think that's the first time I've seen... Uh... The uh, the splat animation for Sonic. Oh yeah. You see those eyes? Yeah, he was a. Uh, like, wait a minute, that puppy killed? Where? Like, jeez. Uh, that was a more horrifying expression than the original uh, Sonic for the Sonic movie. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh my dead. goodness! Yeah, is it just me or is Astro moving faster than the Hedgehog right now? I, you know, yeah. I don't think it's you. I mean, yeah, kind of our socks are definitely being taken pretty fast. Yeah, he is uh, uh -oh. setting, the, setting the pace right now. Check it out. Good nice stuff. Alright, that's a very, very good uh, usage of the zoning tools in right. Rector's kit. Uh, and and Zekrom just kind of moving around and trying to avoid them as best as they can, but unfortunately for right. them, they are unrelenting. That's right. They, they will not stop. Somebody please stop now. Yeah, Astro is not looking like he's even be stopped right now. Check it, check it out. Still hanging on to three stocks. Dude, Cross is such a good option in this matchup because it just completely uh, negates any approach option that Zekrom wants to do. That's right. Especially returning Cross. Oh, you see that mix up there? Two downers yeah, on the was... platform? Oh my goodness. Oh, Very that. cute. Yeah, Astel just kinda trying to trying to, you know, stall. Uh and, and make sure Zekrom's approaching so they can take the stop first. Right. This looks like Tuesday for them, even though it's a Wednesday. Uh. Yikes. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no. Alright, Will. Let's move this. A little Zekrom approach, yes. Yeah. Okay, uh, Good forward tilt. Let's we'll see what our. Oh, tries to go for the axe to catch the recovery, and uh, yeah, Zekrom's. Fortunately, gonna be the wiser not to fall for that, but it's gonna be a lot more work need to get themselves safely back on stage. I think Zekron's just kind of uh, prolonging the inevitable at this point. And there's yeah. the double down tilt at the ledge, and uh, game one goes to Acetil. Yeah, strong, strong finish. Bit of a mishap off stage, Very. but we're seeing some uh, impeccable stuff here. Look at that solid. That their biggest issue was just a little bit of a miscue on their part. I think they have this uh, this set pretty much figured out. Right. Yeah, 
that's a bit of a a bit of an interesting matchup, because I, I definitely don't think I'll be seeing this every day. I mean, what was the last I'm like, you know, here here in Arizona, Asuka's a pretty prominent Richter name. And then we also have, like, Yuri and uh, Dishonest Mong. Uh, yeah. So we have a, you know, compared to, like, some other regions, we have a pretty good coverage with the Belmonts. Um, yeah, I agree. But, um, like, and then we don't have too many Sonic games either. But, like, we have, like, well, a handful. But, like, you know... Very rare that we see them on stream, and it's even more rare that we see them on stream like, at the same time. Yeah, the one after the other. Right. You, sometimes we one or the other every so rarely, but this right here, pretty interesting. I, you know, I, I really can't see this matchup being better than a uh, minus one for Sonic. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's not really too bad. Because I want disadvantage is not all that great. Yeah, but I mean. I, I, I think Kutch can play your strengths, but I mean, I'm sure somebody like Group B Striker could probably uh, prove me wrong here, because uh, they play super aggressively um, with options that aren't just spin dash. Right. So, like, I, I still think Cross is a really, really powerful option, uh, and, and, you know, Acetil has one out pretty much at all times whenever they're uh, on that bigger part of the platform. It does such a good job of just negating any approaches and making sure that Amaterasu, or excuse me, Amaterasu jumps over it so that they can get like a cheeky corner. Right. Yeah, that, that's kind of that's kind of what I'm seeing here as well. But I mean, whether or not on top of that, yeah, wh whether or not uh, Amaterasu is going to be admitting to that. Or just like really aware of that, it's something that we'll have to uh, hope for. Yeah. Plus, it seems like Sonic has a really difficult time of killing in this matchup. Right. And uh, yeah, this is this isn't looking great, my friend. Right. I still just kind of running a, yeah. a train over Zekrom. A two stars lead and everything. Okay, there's an up smash though. That's gonna kill. And uh, Acetil in a very good position still. Zekrom needs to uh, take two stocks before losing one of theirs if they want to go to a game three. Right. Oh man. 83%. Barely recovers that. Yeah. Themselves back on stage now, but again, Astil is just controlling the stage, controlling just about every single interaction that how much also would be looking for. Trying to close in with the spin dash, stuffs it out with the Nair. That, that's been a pretty uh, consistent option as well. Seems like that Nair is pretty consistent at beating out neutral beat. Or I'm sorry, uh, side being laid down. As the first option. Right. Down air. Not gonna. Alright, it is gonna end up resulting in a back air. Very hyper sense there for Zekrom. One more hit and it's over. Right. Oh no. Oh, falls just in time to avoid getting hit by the axe, but is met on stage with holy water back air. Yeah. And there's a fist bump. Zekrom Amaterasu, or excuse me, Amaterasu bows out, getting 2-0'd. 